Hey guys, what's up? I am on top of a roof in my backyard right now, laying out the dirt. Um, step one, or step two of the mineralized topsoil process is you gotta let it soak, then you gotta let it dry, and then you gotta do it over and over. So this is the first dry out period. Um, it's, it's been soaking for two days, and uh, so it's about two o'clock in the afternoon right now, and here in sunny, sunny California, sunny Southern California, it's about 90 degrees in February, so it's kind of ridiculous. Um, I don't know if any of you guys have been watching on the news, but we're going through quite a drought right now. Uh, water levels are lower than they've ever been. But anyway, that's another subject. Um, good for me, though, because I get to dry out my dirt in February. Um, if you're wondering why I'm on a roof, it's because I want to get... This is the only place I could think to lay it out where cats can't get to it and make it their litter box. I'd be pretty unhappy about that. Uh, so yeah, it's been sitting up here for about five minutes. I just ran and got my, my phone and taking this quick video. Uh, so yeah, this is the first time it's been laid out in the sun. It'd be interesting to see what it looks like when it's all dry. Um, I'm gonna take a picture after each dry cycle to show the uh, progress of, of the mineralizing process between each step. Um, I'm assuming, I'm hoping to see the dirt look different between each dry out process. It should, it should start to look uh, more and more like sand and gray and, and the texture should start changing. Uh, the, the soil should change after each dry out process. So, all right guys, I'm gonna get off the roof, off this roof, it's hot up here. So, uh, thanks for watching guys. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, suggestions, uh, anything, I'm, I'm open to it. So, all right guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.